It's a beloved East End landmark that was destroyed by a fire in 2016. Yeah, but the Sag Harbor Cinema is rebuilt and it's open for business now. Our, our Doug Gede takes us inside in tonight's edition of We're Open. You're looking at one of the most famous signs on all of Long Island. As soon as you see it, you know what it is. Well, from the front, not from the back. The Sag Harbor Movie Theater. It burned down in 2016, but it's been completely refurbished and... We're open! It's lovely to come into a place and sort of be drenched immediately in history. Every single person has a story about this cinema. But the most recent history of this cinema is sad, a fire that caused massive damage and massive anguish for the locals. But that's when the entire community rallied. We raised millions. From people throwing coins in a box to sizable donations from well-known locals, a nonprofit entity oversaw a multi-million dollar renovation. There was one cinema here that was 474 seats. Now there's three, uh, the largest of which is 261 seats. There's only two cinemas in the entire state of New York that are rated 10 out of 10 on Dolby's sound scale, and this is one of them. We'll also be doing a bar upstairs. It'll be called the Green Room, and it's got some of the best views in Sag Harbor. Third floor, looking out 180 degrees of windows and a beautiful deck. We've got a cement uh, stone block top for the bar. It is right in the heart of downtown. It's a place where you can go to dinner, you can come see a movie, you can go out afterwards to a bar, you can grab a cup of coffee. This cinema is a beloved 110-year-old community asset, and it doesn't belong to anybody. We're all just kind of midwifing it for the next generation that comes along. For a list of what's playing at the cinema now, go to our website, news12.com. In Sag Harbor, Doug Geeb, News 12 Long Island. And we have many more stories to tell about your businesses and how you're surviving the pandemic. You can watch them right now or you can submit your business for us to come and visit. Go to our website, news12.com and click under We're Open.